and CSS for the last base move. Plus one. Really kind of difficult to get around sometimes. Yeah. But... And, like, the, the high ceiling is also kind of lackluster for Fox. Because it's much harder to kill off the top. But we're going to go straight into it. This is also historically one of uh, IC's worst stages. It's better now because this is the Launchables version. Oh, yeah, because it, there's guaranteed platform setups at yeah. least on the blue platforms. Yeah, because so. sometimes the... Oh, my God, Nana went to the right and hit oh. blank. And uh, murders him. Oh, my. Kills his teammate Kills on his accident. Teammate. <laughs> so we're actually going to be, like, locked in stocks here. Okay, so now Entropy and Burr have a uh, this stock. This is a... Stock up, mm -hmm. and this is actually going a lot better for HP and Burn than I thought it would. Uh oh. But, Man, he got killed sub 50. This is a got, slobber knocker. They're, yeah, they're just swinging. This is crazy. He's going to try and wall out, but he's eating a knee for it. He might get this. Can't even oh save my his God. teammate. And this could be an edgeguard opportunity. Nope. Yeah, Leon is just going to back off. Kind of let Blank do his thing. Yeah, Fox off stage again. Oh, he dropped too low. Probably tried to wall jump, missed the wall jump. <laughs> Sometimes it's kind of hard to wall jump, like, because you have to drift in. Depending on how you wall jump, you have to drift in with your stick. And if you don't do it correctly, you might not touch the wall. Yeah. Jump, so. so, this is a good turnaround. Now it's in uh, Youngblood and Blank's favor. But they're kind of corralling him in pretty well. Oh, he's, he's at raw knee trying to save his teammate. Nana just kind of acting a fool over there. And oh, Youngblood is nowhere to be found off stage. Youngblood is just swinging, hitting everybody. Which may end up working in their favor because they do have the, uh, the stock up. Sometimes like, when you have stock ups in uh, doubles, it's a little bit less uh, detrimental to strike your teammate if it means you can like, kill someone yeah. else. So, uh, good job recovering there. And... Uh, he might get the kill on Youngblood here. Nope. Go straight to the ledge. He just gets struck by that back air. There's so much going on. Yeah, this is it's, like this is actually kind of difficult to even pay attention to for me because they are just swinging. There's really no like form or function here. Yeah. You don't see any like team stuff <laughs> yeah. where there's like a dedicated point. Someone's in the front. Someone's in the back. Like everybody is just attacking swinging. constantly. Oh my, good setup. See, that is why I don't know how they even got to Delfinos. That would have been my first game. Yeah. He straight up used every jump possible and still made it back yep. by going dipping low. And giving Falcon space to move is so bad. Like, if you give him space to move and doubles, then he'll just run around. And that extra space isn't going to help you against the knee. You're just going to explode half the time. And there's like this thing that people don't really think about in doubles much is like just because you didn't kill them doesn't mean that the space you gained isn't worth it right especially against characters that take a long time to recover mm -hmm. like ice climbers they kind of just like float on by uh samus it works too uh mm -hmm. snake to an extent ddd um sometimes just that extra like time alone 2v1 is good enough yeah but exactly you have to capitalize right and it did not look like they were willing to capitalize because they were swinging like mad. Yeah. But we have, uh, what was that? Not Metal Cavern. Uh, yeah, FD and PS2 banned out. They might be redoing bands, I guess. By the way, Wario's in FOD. They have, they're dumb. There's two bands. They only banned one. Oh, well. Doesn't really matter much. Uh, I still don't even really agree with the stage. Yeah, I don't either. Because, again, there's just more space. And, like, Falcon, if you just are tanky enough and you're good at survival DI, big stages also just help. Yeah. Because you can just kind of sit. Oh, my. So, Nana ate up a lot of percent there and just ate a raw knee and just died for it. So, this is going to be significantly harder to keep this uh, this neutral stocking right here. So, right. you just got crappy popo mm -hmm. with... Youngblood and uh, Blank fishing for Burr. Can't protect his teammate. Good, Dies. good conversion off the down throw. Murders him in the head. And I've noticed that uh, Entropy and Burr really like doing the 1 2 2 1 setup where they corral them in the corner, but they aren't really capitalizing too much at walling them out. Yeah. And they're letting, uh, they're letting Youngblood cross them up a lot. 
Especially with Falcon, if you get him stuck in the corner, you really want to keep him there. Right. Because then that happens. You yeah. just get raw need and you just kind of die. Yeah, they're not keeping Youngblood in the corner, and then whoever's fighting Blank is losing the it's 1v1. He's losing the neutral, yeah. He's losing the 1v1. So, it's looking pretty rough. So they're each they're they're kind of keeping this two like a one v one setup really, which they're not really like using the strengths of their other teammates being available. But if you're winning the one v one, it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Much, so. Young boy throwing out some hitbox there, trying to save, gets the raw knee. Oh, and then murders them both. That's murders fine. Them both. Doesn't even matter. He's up. They're stocks. up two stocks total. So as long as uh, Young Blood can hold on to this one, but it doesn't look like he'll be able to. Really good get up attack to yeah. save or to keep Blank off. And Youngblood just needs his teammate raw. Thankfully, he's just has really good recovery. But, oh, they're just floundering on this edge guard opportunity. See, that's the other thing that's like kind of awkward about ZSS specifically is that she's kind of a character that can kind of linger out. Mm -hmm. So, if you spend too much time focusing on her edge guard and you see that your teammate is losing, like sometimes it's best to just kind of let her back on. Yeah. Because she can have all the time in the world. Just kind of and uh, see, this is this is the issue right here. Oh. And not only does she linger out there, she's able to get back onto the stage very yeah. quickly. So it's not necessarily that she's lingering; it's that she's stalling. She's stalling. So that right. that whole time, the her teammate can just come and help her or come reverse edge guard you. It's really hard to get her in doubles. Yeah, and she, she kind of falls under the idea, like, of the same idea for me as, like, DDD, Snake. Sometimes if they're off stage, you kind of just want to ignore them. Yeah. Because there's so many ways for her to safely recover. Oh, uh, that like, should. Uh, oh, like drops it. Uh-oh. Just hits the laser. Takes him out. Just top three best of three. Yeah. Or, yeah. I I'm gonna be that honest with you, that was kind of hard to focus on. Yeah, that was, it was very chaotic.